Canadian mother is sounding the alarm after she was served cleaning fluid instead of a latte at McDonald's. You're watching What's Trending, I'm Shira Lazar. Be sure to like this video and subscribe for more social media news daily. Sarah Douglas is from the town of Lethbridge, about 130 miles south of Calgary in Alberta, Canada. She was taking her son to a baseball tournament when she decided to go through the McDonald's drive-thru to get a coffee. Sarah Douglas still remembers the tingling sensation in her mouth after she ordered what she thought was a latte at the Westside McDonald's. I had no idea of what I was drinking. I just knew it wasn't coffee and it tasted like chemical. It turned out the milk in her latte wasn't milk at all, but cleaning fluid. You heard me, cleaning fluid. That's what gives coffee its rich, full-bodied flavor. According to Dan Brown, the franchisee at that location, the milk supply line for the coffee machine was still connected to the cleaning solution. Like, how does that happen? I know like things happen, but that's a big mistake. And by the way, Sarah was eight months pregnant, so she was not going to be chill. I smell a lawsuit. She also went through the ingredients of the cleaner she ingested. And it contains things like fatty alcohol polyglycol ether and potassium metasilicate that you really shouldn't be ingesting. Of course, because she spit out the drink right away, the doctors did say that she was fine as well as her baby. But she wants McDonald's and all restaurants to focus on proper training and health considerations so this kind of thing doesn't happen. But look, there are over 15,000 McDonald's locations in North America. Everyone's trained on changing the tubes from the cleaner to the milk. But just statistically, once in a while, someone's going to forget to change the tubes. It's never going to be 100% reliability. Mistakes happen. But this is McDonald's and they have a lot of money, including to pay off someone who might have drank cleaning fluid. And you might be wondering, has this happened before? Well, yes. An Indianapolis police officer, Paul Watkins, got cleaning solution in his tea in 2015. He fills this cup with ice, you know, he gets half unsweetened tea and he goes to fill it with uh, sweet tea and he thought it looked kind of dark, took the lid off, he said, didn't see anything wrong with it takes a drink of it and the initial, you know, whole thing is burning. And in 2013, another family filed a lawsuit after a teenage boy vomited from ingesting McDonald's iced tea with cleaning fluid. Ay, ay, ay. But it's not just McDonald's. In 2014, a woman named Jan Harding spent several days in the hospital after drinking iced tea that had been mistakenly sweetened with lye at Dickie's Barbecue Pit in Utah. That last case was settled outside the court and we have a sneaking suspicion that the other McDonald's cases were done in that way too. Now I know what you're thinking, you sick, sick people. Do not put cleaning fluid in any of your drinks thinking that you'll get a settlement. It's just gonna make you sick and it's very dangerous. Seriously, we do not want to be reporting about a McDonald's cleaning fluid challenge this summer. As far as that McDonald's in Canada goes, inspectors from Alberta Health checked out the location, determined it was a one-time mistake, and said there isn't an ongoing investigation. So what would you have done if this happened to you? Let us know in the comments below, and be sure to like and subscribe for more of What's Trending.